Gotcha. There we go. Oh my gosh. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Slam Bed Doors. In today's episode I'm fishing with my dad out here on Caesars Creek. We're gonna fish for really whatever we can catch today. It is, as you can see, very beautiful out today. It's about 55, windy, not really ideal fishing conditions, but you know, for fall, we'll take it. Um, we actually got minnows today, something I haven't really done in a while, but we're really just going to try to get on some kind of bite today, whether it's bass, walleye, bluegill, not bluegill, but bass, walleye, crappie. Let's see what we can catch today. So. Right now, I'm not doing anything different than I do when it's July, so I'll see how well that's going to work. I need to retie, but I'm not going to do it yet, so. I just not. Yeah, flop didn't matter. <laughs> Eight and a half. Just cut the hook off it. Yeah, I can do that. Thank you. <laughs> Feels pretty big, but it's because he's coming out of a tree. Yeah, darn, he got it the first time. Mistakes were made. That's what I was going to guess it was. Two more casts, and then I'm going to. Go back to the original plan. I had a tap. Oh, my dad drop shotting has been ended for me. Oh no. And that's okay. It was about time to break out the big guns. Guns being multiple, because there are five of them. Oh, only three of them effective, so. Three loaded guns and two unloaded ones. Gotcha. There we go. Oh my gosh. Oh yes. I knew they ate it. <laughs> First bass on the Alabama rig. Yeah. First cast. Look at that. That's awesome. Picture? Oh my gosh, he totaled it. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> he did. Oh, that's gonna be ten minutes of my ten minutes of my life right there. I thought he was like five. Oh, I know when he jumped. <laughs> that's awesome. I'm, I'm just gonna get him back. He's a good, good two pounder. Are you sure? Okay. Yeah, I'm sure. 
Yes! Right. Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> hold on, hold on. No, I, I can't. That was one cast of this thing. I got. If I can't salvage it, I'll be good to go home. But I think I, I think I can salvage it. Problem with boat flipping those things is now it's bent. <laughs> but I fixed it. I was like, he was just there. That was awesome. I threw that thing up there pretty shallow too. He hit it right by the boat though. First bet, it's five swim baits with a bunch of wires going everywhere, you know? It's just not convincing. Oh, I, 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 did, I just had another one hit it. I don't know. I don't know if it was a bass or not, but something definitely hit it. Second bass I've ever caught on the right-handers. Ah, darn it. I don't, I mean, maybe it's getting down, but I don't, I don't know. That's true. Now, is I want to know if they're, are they eating the swim baits at a high capacity, or are they eating Alabama rigs at a, at a low capacity and not eating swim baits? This is what I kind of want to know. Because it's like, was that bass that he was he just swimming by and he saw oh little swim bait I'm gonna eat that and he couldn't have noticed that it was an A rig, or was that was that a bass that saw it and was like oh yeah, look at this school of bait bunch you know? Oh that was a hundred percent of fish. Darn it. I just got thumped like right there. Yo, yeah, what on it? Thank mm -hmm. you.